Hi, Roy Knifton here from Zoll Medical. We're just going to spend a few minutes reviewing how to use capnography on the intubated patient with the Zoll M series. We're going to start out with the uh, end tidal CO2 uh, sensor not attached to the M series. We're going to find the connector on the back of the M series and we're going to connect the sensor like this and turn on the monitor. Next, we're going to press the Wave 2 button to bring up the CO2 waveform on the bottom of the screen. You'll see that we're in warm-up mode, but it will display a waveform and a respiratory rate, as you'll see in just a minute. With the uh, clear airway adapter already attached in, in the sensor, we're going to attach this to the patient's ET tube and use the BVM and now we can bag the patient. While we're bagging the patient, you'll see the, uh, the waveform and the respiration rate show up on the screen. As you can see, we have an end tidal value of 41 millimeters of mercury and a respiration rate of 13. Now that the warm-up message has gone away, you'll just continue to monitor end tidal CO2. Hi, Roy Knifton from Zoll Medical. We're just going to discuss zeroing the end tidal CO2 sensor on the M series. The first time that this sensor is attached to this monitor, they need to be paired by zeroing them. And we, uh, we no longer use these gray reference cells, but what we do is we put the clear airway adapter in the sensor, and we go to the screen and press the parameter button, and then we scroll up to end tidal CO2, enter, and then we press zero. Next thing, we press enter, and it will uh, zero as soon as the monitor is warmed up and it's ready to zero that out. Ready? Yep. It'll take about 15 seconds and it'll say zeroing CO2 adapter on the screen. It'll blink on and off and then it'll say zero done. That should be the last time that you need to zero this, uh, this sensor to pair it to this monitor. The only other time you might need to zero it is if you're using a neonatal adapter on an ET tube size 4 millimeters or less. The neonatal adapter looks just like this, but it has a purple tint to it, and it's a low dead space adapter with a, a, a smaller opening inside. If you were to put one of those neonatal adapters in here, you would need to zero it to use it, and then once you went back to the adult adapter, you would zero it again.